My favorite thing that I've seen at the Biennale. Um, the favorite one is the France uh, Pavilion for the architecture inside, and the, today there was a live performance, so I love them. My favorite thing that I've seen on this Biennale was the Israel Pavilion with the huge sculpture that looked like a cloud. I like the project with this big horse and little woman. For me, it's very important if the art can make real, truth feeling in my soul. That was good. Also, this other thing we saw. I can't say that I like uh, almost anything here this year, but I could say what uh, I don't like the most. Finnish pavilion, too. Yeah, it was funny. That was really funny, like with the puppets and the humor. We were like actually laughing. Hello, and welcome to Finland. Yeah, one of my favorite things is the Austrian exhibition place. It's very uh, interesting, it's something outstanding. Good ideas from the artists, and I really like it very much. Most impressive was the German pavilion, it was the first one we saw. I just read yesterday that the German artist got the prize for it, and I was very excited. We come from Taiwan, Asia, so maybe cannot understand what Europeans think. <laughs> but the art creation is the same. I think the biennial is important because it gives artists a platform to amplify their voices. And there is a place where they can be shown and also recognized. It's defining what, what are the trends and which, what is happening in contemporary art. The idea is that if we can uh, be able to reflect in a good way, we can create good uh, feelings, good vibes and uh, good solutions. It's all about beauty. It's all about the motion from the heart. It's, about, it's all about the language you present as an artwork.